Children, how are you all? I hope you all are fit and fine and studying well. I'm your Momita ma'am and I'm, again I'm here to take your English class. Children, take out your English book and your English copy. Today you will start writing from P. In our last class, children, we have finished up to O. So today we will begin from P. One more thing, children and parents, I'm telling you also, if you have difficulties writing five letters in one line, you can write four letters also. In my first class, I, I think I told you that either four letters or five letters will be there in one line. In that case, A, B, C, D, like this also you have to write. No problem with that. Okay. And first you have to finish the capital letters. Then you have to do small letters. I think you have two copies for English. So in one copy you write capital letters and another copy you practice writing small letters. It will be easier for the children. So don't write together how I am doing because I have no space. A shorter place so I'm doing it together but for copies you write first capital letters then you do small letters okay so get ready with your copy and book children open page number 53 today we will start from P this is P P for puppy P for pain P for pumpkin P for pan so here is P for periwinkle. Trace and write the letter P. Here you have to trace straight line and this half circle. This way you have to trace first these dots. Then in this blank space you have to write it like this. Here is one skill sheet. That is for you children. This will be your homework. I will tell you the page numbers later. This one you have to color. This parachute you have to color. And the bunny also you have to color. Next comes Q, Q for quiver, Q for question mark, Q for Q, Q for quarter, Q for quill. Again this stressing is there, you have to do this dotted lines, you have to do one straight line, another line and this half circle. This way you have to trace this and in this blank space one straight line, this way the half circle and one another line so you have to do it like this then here comes another skill sheet children say aloud each picture's name and all the names start with letter Q write Q's in the quilt and color it also this will be your homework next comes R R for rat R for ring R for road R for rain we have already learned these pages are for raspberry so you have to trace these dotted lines this way you have to do children and again this blank space you have to write it like this okay and here one matching is there children match the robots with the picture that begin with letter R what is this children rainbow so R for rainbow what is this children radish R for radish what is this children Goat. This is not starting with R. So, this is once again one other robot and this is rose. So, you have to draw one line from this robot to this rose. Our next work is here you have to circle the letter. Circle the correct letter for the each picture. Some pictures are given children. You have to circle the correct letter that is starting with this. Picture is starting with that letter. Okay, you have to circle the correct letter. Then comes S. S for spider. S for shocks. S for star. S for spoon. Then again stressing S for skirt. So how you have to write? This is children small s. Okay, the stressing is you are doing is a small s. In this blank space, you have to write it like this. Okay. Yes, this is small s. This is one skill sheet. Say aloud each picture's name and all the names are starting with s. And color the Santa also. This Santa Claus you have to color. Okay. And these pictures also you have to say aloud the names. And this is T. T for tomato. T for Toy, T for tap, T for tent, T for tulip. So how you have to write? T. This is 
T. This way you have to do this stressing. Yes. Then in this blank space you have to write it like this. You have to write it like this. Okay. And the skill sheet is there. Let's see what is there in the skill sheet. Say aloud each picture's name. All the names start with letter T. Color the pictures also. You have to say the picture's name. What is this? Like teddy bear, tree, table, tub. And you have to color this. Okay children. Now write the page numbers. That will be your homework. Then I will start with the board. Page number 44, 45, 47, 48. 50, 51 and 52. This will be your homework. Okay. Now look at the both children. I will write the capital letters. Look at the both children. I have already written. This is capital P. This is small p. This is capital Q. This is small q. This is capital R. This is small r. This is capital S. This is small s. This is capital T. This is small t. So, look at the both children, how you have to write. P, this is small. This is capital Q. This is small Q. This is capital R. This is small r. This is capital S. This is small s. This is capital T. This is small t. Once again, children, I am writing capital P, small p, capital Q, this is small q, capital R, this is small r, capital S, small s, capital T, small t. So, this way you have to practice, but write the capital letters first. And then you write the small letters. Don't write it like this. As I already told you. And if you are having any difficulties writing 5 letters in one line. You can write 4 letters also. And if you have any queries you can ask me. If you have any doubts, any queries parents you can ask me. There will be no problem. I am ready to answer. Okay. So write the homework page numbers. Children page number 44. 45, 47, 48, 50, 51 and 52. This will be your homework. Some coloring is also there. I think children you will enjoy it. Take care of yourselves children. Study well. God bless you. Bye bye.